Microsoft has just taken the wraps off its latest offering, the Surface Laptop Studio 2, and the initial impression looks promising, especially when compared to its predecessor. But the real question is whether it can outshine its competitor, the M2 MacBook Pro. Let's find out. Are you struggling to explain your idea? Your audience is not getting what you're trying to say. An animated explainer video is a perfect solution for you. Explainer video simplifies any complex ideas through engaging animations, transitions, voiceovers, and meaningful scripts, which all together create a fun experience for any viewer. And here comes Ten Studio, a team of skilled professionals dedicated to creating engaging explainer videos. With over thousands completed projects, we have the expertise to create explainer videos that break down your message and connect with your audience. Get in touch with Ten Studio today. Starting with the design, the Surface Laptop Studio 2 retains a similar layout to its predecessor, sporting a 14-inch display. It flaunts a platinum aluminum finish that screams sophistication. One unique feature is the woven fabric hinge that allows the device to transform 180 degrees, offering versatility in form. However, it's worth noting that it's a bit on the thick and heavy side, weighing in at 4.37 pounds. It's equipped with two Thunderbolt 4 ports, a USB-A, a microSD slot, a 3.5mm audio jack, and a Surface Connect port. Also, the mechanical backlit keys, including functional keys for Windows and media controls, add to its usability. Besides, the customizable haptic trackpad seamlessly transitions the device to tablet form. It's all about versatility and functionality. Now, on the Apple side, the M2 MacBook Pro also boasts a 14-inch display and follows the same traditional Pro design outline available in silver and space gray. It's built with aluminum alloy, ensuring durability and a premium feel. It features the MagSafe 3 port, 3 Thunderbolt 4 ports, a microSD card slot, a 3.5mm headphone jack, and an HDMI port. However, if you're craving even more power, there's also a 16-inch MacBook Pro option. For the keyboard, it's using the backlit Magic Keyboard, but although the MacBook Pro does not come with a touchscreen display, it does include a touch bar for advanced functionality. As we can see, neither Microsoft nor Apple brought any significant changes when it came to the design of the product, because they're more focused on upgrading their internal capabilities and overall performance. Now, let's talk screens. The Surface Laptop Studio 2 boasts a 14.4-inch Pixel Sense Flow touchscreen with a 2400x1600 resolution. It offers a silky smooth 120Hz refresh rate, HDR Dolby Vision support, and a 1080p front camera for your video conferencing needs. Now, on the other side, the M2 MacBook Pro rocks a 14.2-inch Liquid Retina XGR display with a stunning 3024x1964 resolution. It features an adaptive refresh rate that goes up to 120Hz and boasts an eye-popping peak brightness of 1600 nits. It also includes a 1080p front camera for video calls, same as the Studio 2. So, when it comes to display, the M2 MacBook Pro screen is nothing short of spectacular with its high resolution, adaptive refresh rate, and incredible brightness, making it a visual delight for any task. However, the PixelSense Flow touchscreen definitely makes it a standout because it can transform the laptop into a full-fledged tablet as well. The 2-in-1 form factor definitely makes it quite a unique choice compared to M2 MacBook Pro. Under the hood, the Surface Laptop Studio 2 is powered by the 13th Gen i7-13700 processor and it offers a choice between an RTX 4050 or RTX 4060 GPU. What's particularly impressive is the dedicated NPU or Neural Processing Unit for enhanced AI support in Microsoft 365 apps, a feature that sets it apart. Now, depending on your GPU choice, it can provide up to 18 hours of battery support. If you're about to get this laptop for work purposes like illustration, art, or editing, you can definitely expect a satisfying work experience. Especially with its AI enhanced capabilities and impressive battery life, it's a workhorse for productivity. On the Apple side, the M2 MacBook Pro is powered by the M2 Pro and M2 Max chips. While these processors might not be the newest, their integrated graphics pack a punch compared to Intel's integrated graphics. It promises a substantial 12 to 18 hours of battery life depending on usage. The M2 MacBook Pro's performance is solid and it offers strong integrated graphics, but it's not as AI-focused as the Surface Laptop Studio 2. Its battery life is also impressive for a workhorse laptop. 
Although the 13th gen CPU integrated graphics game is not that strong, but the additional NVIDIA GPU support on the Surface MacBook Pro definitely makes the Surface Laptop Studio 2 a strong contender. However, the M2 Pro and M2 Max chips are still a pretty solid choice when it comes to productivity. Now, both these 14-inch models come in at a similar price range. The Surface Laptop Studio 2 starts at $19.99 for the base model and can go up to $36.99 for the upgraded version. The 14-inch M2 MacBook Pro starts at $19.99 and goes up to $3,099. If you're eyeing the 16-inch models, they can go as high as $34.99. So we can pretty much say that both devices offer competitive pricing for their respective specifications and features. In the end, the Surface Laptop Studio 2 stands out with its AI-enhanced capabilities, seamless transition to tablet mode, and compatibility with the Surface Slim Pen 2. It offers versatility in a sleek package, especially for those who value AI integration and hybrid functionality. For them, it can be a great choice. On the other hand, the M2 MacBook Pro focuses on delivering a powerful conventional laptop experience with its stunning display and impressive battery life. Now, it may not have a touchscreen or AI features, but it's a workhorse on its own right. The M2 MacBook Pro is a solid choice for those who prioritize performance and the classic MacBook experience. So, should you be choosing the Surface Laptop Studio 2 over the M2 MacBook Pro? Well, you can't go wrong with either, but your decision should be based on your priorities, whether it's AI capabilities, versatility, or the classic Apple experience.